Hello everyone. Uh, rain testing, wet weather testing. It's a strange day today, it's about 14 degrees and pouring with rain. Been out for an hour and a quarter so far. Um, Heather, Carol, for you, I'm wearing uh, a vest I've made from Everest. Um, and it's the woven PES front. Um, so this is definitely for me a way to go for front panels and shoulder panels to see a jacket hopefully later. Um, much, much better than full stretch, so the knitted face um, just doesn't get so cold, doesn't absorb so much moisture. I've had to actually wash in the DWR on this. And also on the back, on this vest you'll see I'm using the yellow, I think it's the 5k, 10k that uh, Heather sent me. Again of Everest, very, very good. First sort of 40 minutes I was riding on the flat, just sort of uh, drizzle and breathable enough to keep it zipped up. You notice if you get stopped at say traffic lights, you notice a bit of sweat build up, feel the humidity rise and it's, it's very, very humid here as well. Where I'm just now, very warm and humid area um, in the south of Europe. But really impressed by the Everest fabric. I would still say our other Minerali partner, Kokona, I prefer those fabrics. I've got the uh, red Harmony 284, my pocket and a half sleeve jacket, which will be on to the descent actually. Um, but yeah, very impressed by the Everest qualities. Um, as usual, we always need to look at DWR. I know Carol's had a project on that anyway. We can always improve that. We're very aware of environmental considerations. But yeah, this two and a half layer Everest, really great fabric, make a really great rain jacket, half sleeve shell, and even into a vest. And actually the jersey I'm wearing underneath has a rain text front, PDG membrane, printable. And I think in the future we could look at using a Neverest of Kokona to make a three season journey. Okay, all for now. Rain testing continues, unfortunately, because the rain continues. Speak to you later. Cheers.